Close my door. What, what are you coming up here? I'm recording. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to Pages of Beauty. Today's video, I am going to do a brand review on a black owned cosmetics brand, Black Opal, and exclusively for Black History Month. So if you're interested, keep on watching. Now, in the beginning, I wasn't so familiar with Black Opal. I know I've seen it a lot of times in the drugstores, basically at the bottom of the barrel of the shelves, and I've always passed it up until recently I did a makeup shoot with one of my closest makeup artist friends, Galvin, and he actually used this brand, Black Opal, on me and completely opened my mind to a whole new sort of array of different products and actually ended up loving the whole looks and how they overall turned out. I know a few of you are familiar with this company and the brand. I recently was introduced to Black Opal about last winter and when I went over to his place and we had everything set up, Black Opal was actually the whole entire brand that he used on me. I was really excited and I was really intrigued to learn about the brand. I didn't know exactly how accessible we really were to the brand. So if you're interested, keep on watching. Okay guys, so I'm going to talk about the products that I have here. I have quite a few. Um, actually my mom and I use this brand a lot and it's actually a really, really great brand. Um, they have everything from foundations, powders, concealers, lipsticks, lip liners, and some accessories and some pro tools as well. And since it's Black History Month, I thought it would be perfect time to do this video for Black Opal. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to talk about is actually going to be the Black Opal Cream Stick Foundations. These are my favorite. I have two of them. One is actually my mom's. I hipped her onto the brand as well and she actually loves Black Opal as well. I ended up placing a huge order on blackopal.com and it was amazing. It's affordable, it's professional quality makeup. That's why I love it so much and it comes in tons of colors you guys. I mean, so the colors that I have here in the cream stick foundations are Nutmeg, which is actually what I have on my face today. Black Walnut. Black Walnut is actually my contour. And then my mom's shade is Truly Topaz. So these are the stick foundations. They are highly pigmented. They're super rich. They're creamy. They last all day. Overall, I really like it because it has a professional feel and a professional wear about them. And they have a nice weight to them. They're not like a cheapy um, drugstore foundation which is what I was expecting and what I thought when I saw Black Opal but Black Opal is actually an amazing brand hypoallergenic dermatologist tested it's not gonna clog your pores it gives medium to full coverage let me see if I can show you the, the shade there <laughs> we'll do it like that I love this foundation. Now I am familiar with the Bubby Brown stick foundation, her cream stick foundation. And actually when I saw Black Walnut, I actually replaced it. One, the Bobbi Brown is very expensive. This was at a more reasonable price and it does the exact same thing and it has a huge range of colors for women of color. Black Opal has shades anywhere between, you know, very fair, um, very yellow, cool toned women to really deep, dark, um, rich and mahogany tones. So this was like my first like purchase from Black Opal. I had to have it. And this is also what Galvin used, my friend who's a pro artist. This is actually what he used on me in his photo shoot. And then when I saw the photos and how amazing that my skin looked and how the pictures turned out, I said, okay, I have to buy Black Opal. And he's like, yeah, girl, how did you not know about Black Opal. Now the next two products I'm actually going to talk about are the Black Opal True Color Cream to Powder. Now these here come in little compacts like this. These were actually my mom's, so <laughs> both of these are hers, but I wanted to show them for the video because she's obsessed. She has two colors. She has the color Beautiful Bronze and she also has the color in Truly Topaz. Julie Topaz is more of a yellow tone. She's about a shade or two lighter than me, depending on the season. 
beautiful bronze. Now I thought I was going to be beautiful bronze in the stick foundation. I ended up getting nutmeg just because it had a little more yellow. But recently she's really, really been liking that's the church bells, you guys. This is beautiful bronze. Now I think I could get away with this color in the summertime, but right now I think it's a little too red. So what she does is she mixes the two. She'll mix beautiful bronze and truly topaz. She loves the cream to powder. These, on the other hand, are more creamy. Um, they glide more, and it takes a little longer for them to dry. Not a long time, but it just takes a little longer for these to dry. But she really, really loves these, and yeah, she's happy. Um, my friend Galvin, the pro makeup artist, also used this on me in the photo shoot as well. And this was the deluxe finishing powder. Now, this is an oil control formula. It's a loose powder. They have about maybe four to five shades. This is actually in the shade medium. So this is number three in medium. And this is actually what I set my concealer and my highlight with. And I wanted something a little warmer for women of color instead of the traditional banana powder because I have my own set of clients as well. And sometimes I notice that the banana powder is a little too yellow. <sighs> like, it's a snow day and the snow truck man is there. So what I'm going to do, this is actually my favorite product by them because it's an oil control formula. It's a loose formula, but why I love it is that it has that really beautiful peachy orange tone, which makes it great for women of color. Close my door. What, what are you coming up here? I'm recording. Okay, so the last thing that's going to be my favorite product from Black Opal. Now I know I said all of my products that I have here are my favorite products, oh. but this one here I actually have almost used all of it, and it is the Black Opal Flawless Concealer. Now this comes in just a little tube of like lipstick, that's what it looks like, it comes with a little cap, and it looks like a little tube of lipstick. This is actually by far my favorite concealer. I have it on today, I have on all Black Opal, <laughs> um, and I actually have it up on under my brows, and I use this for concealing, I use it for highlighting, I use it to clean up my brows. I really, really like it because I believe this is actually a really great dupe for the NARS Creamy Concealer in shade Caramel. So if you guys are looking for a great concealer, one that's going to last all day, it's creamy, it's highly pigmented, it gives amazing coverage and it stays on so you guys check out black opal for women of color it's an amazing brand it's an amazing product line and the coverage is superior so you guys that is actually gonna sum up my whole brand review for black opal and the products that I have and use from them I especially want to shout this brand out because it is a very important time for us we the people will continue to stand strong and to fight for what we believe in and to fight for what's right and to continue for love and world peace. Thanks so much for watching guys and happy Black History Month. Mwah.